What's going on? Back plugged in again with your boy the Prophet. Hey yo, man. So today we've got some never before seen colored images of the new hell art turned from the bowels of hell. I covered this manga chapter. It was a one shot. It was 73 pages or 63 pages, one of the two. I will link the hell arc chapter in the description. I know a lot of beautiful guys and girls are here because the hype for Bleach is going. We just got the amazing anime PV trailer. Animation looks absolutely astounding. And I've been one of the people supporting Bleach for years, even in the dark times, okay? Even in the before poor times, I was here. So if you wanna support somebody that's been loyal to the series, make sure you smack that like button and subscribe to the channel. So we're gonna go ahead and go over illustrating the Bleach Hell art. The Hell arc is the new arc that's coming. There's only been a one shot talking about it. It's being worked on as we know right now. Let's go ahead and admire this beautiful art. Taking a look, the first one is Ichigo Kurosaki. Number one, of course, makes a lot of sense. This looks really good. My only issue with this is that it's not colored. Um, and then like, it didn't even like no like crazy emotion on his face and stuff like that. This Ichigo, I love the expression on his face. The art style, of course, is very, very good, okay? Everyone after that is completely fully colored. All these other characters are from the Hell Arc, all right? So these are colored images that we've never seen before ever. This Udiu, like the drip, you feel me? The teal vest that kind of matches the background color. You know, he still has his bow. You know, he still got the white drip with the robe, of course, paying homage. Udiu looks very, very clean. Yasutoro Sato. Um, Chad looks very good. Uh, I didn't read Chad's novel, but there's like a novel where Chad's like a boxer and stuff. So maybe we'll get some information about that. So I'll make sure I link the Discord server. All these images are in one in the art gallery section. Honestly, when I saw them 12 year Kaden and Yuzu, I didn't even recognize them. I was like, yo, who that? They look amazing. This is little sis Nim, bro. I said this on stream that if there's ever a sequel to Bleach, I guarantee you, Kadin will be someone's advisor, or she's gonna be, you know, in the main story, like helping whoever the main character is figure stuff out. I promise you, they've set up way too much stuff for Kadin, okay? Kadin, she might have some part to play in the Hell Arc. I could be too soon, but I don't know, man. Like, it's been 12 years since we've seen her, bro. She's had to have been seeing ghosts and having relationships uh, with, you know, ghosts and stuff like that. Like, you know, talking to them, stuff like Ichigo, you know, laying flowers down, stuff like that. This right here is uh, Ikumi Unagi. Is that is that her name? Um, Unagi, or this is Ichigo's boss, her husband, who we've pretty much never seen. This Raruka, bro, they're in chat, they're like, she's, that's the perfect tsundere pose. Basically, like, she just looks like all cute, like, mm, like, I don't want to pose, but like, here it is. Mm. Like, looks very cool, bro. Like, her drip is nice. Like, I like the blouse she has. Like, I like the little ruffles or whatever. It's dope. Like, she kind of looks like nobility, kind of, in my personal opinion. Like, she looks like kind of, you know, like she has, you can see her earrings and stuff. Like she's not wearing any necklace or whatever, but you can tell she has like, I don't know. Like she looks kind of like real to He looks really cool, bro. He looks really, I, I like how Yukio looks. He's like a billionaire philanthropist. Like look at Moe, Moe, Shishigawada. He's grown up, bro. Like, so I say he done found his luck in the business industry or in the stock industry or something, bro. Like, he looks like a like he look like a hoodlum, bro. Like a like a low-key Yakuza member or something. Like he or looks like honestly, bro, like love or a hater, bro. Like, this is a dope image of Hiori. Like, this looks very, very cool, bro. This looks very cool. I, I don't know, I, li I like everybody's color schemes. Like, look at love. This man, Love Aikawa. 
Bro, this is some drip. This is some freaking drip, bro. Like, he looks so freaking savage, bro. He looks so savage, so dope, so swagged out. You you look like you want to care about this dude. Like, you look like you see this image and you like, what he do? Like, he looks dope, bro. Hachi with the beard gang. I think this is a good look for Hachi. Pink beard, like you can't really draw that very often, right? Like, pink beard, bro. Hachi looks hella dope. I can't get. I don't like the pose like that. I don't really like that pose for a big dude. Like, why are you posing like that type shit? But, um, Kazui, which I'm not sure why Kazui is like number 16 or whatever. Like, I feel like that's a weird number. I said this on the stream, like, I wish that this little ribbon thing wasn't there blocking him because I want to see his smile. Like, Kazui's smile, like, is one of those ones, like, makes you smile. You know what I mean? So, I don't know. I think it would have been cool, um, if you could see his, like, full, you know, the full expression on his face. Like, see the gleefulness. You know, I wish you could see that. That would be uh, pretty dope. Ichika, um, so, so for those of you that don't know, Ichika and Kazui, of course, as you see by the last names, this is Renji and Rukia's daughter right so you can see she basically has Renji's like hair with basically Rukia's face like I'm gonna uh, zoom this in quite a lot and um you guys can like if you can really see like if you see her and then you see Rukia her face looks almost exactly like Rukia okay now just put that on the screen she looks very mischievous in this pose and in the hell arc uh, Yumi Chika, I mean, um, Ikaku is her, you know, her sword teacher, uh, her, her kendo instructor, and, um, she's, like, just super mischievous with him, like, you know, talking about her math, he's gotten better, and, you know, he, he, you know, she's, she's the student, but she's telling him, like, you're, you're, you're getting much better, master, like, she crazy, bro, a lot of personality in her, but, yeah, this Renji, he looks very, like, Mm, he looks like savage bro like he looks like he's was very stern and whatever he was doing or he looks like he had like a face like he was in an, a battle basically that he was enjoying right like you know it was a good battle but like he don't look like beat up bruised and stuff like that but he looks like he's really about to exert himself with whatever the strike he's about to do um with Zabi model look at i bro i love rukia's face bro like Especially her adult face. It's like more smooth rather than like round or whatever like it used to be. It's more like oval shaped. And I don't know. Like I think adult Rukia looks like a way cooler character. Like her hair is longer and stuff. She looks mature, bro. Like I want to see what this character's personality is like. You know, like. She's a captain now, like right before she could be uh, innocent and, you know, like faint, not faint ignorance, but basically that's what it was like, you know, a lot of stuff happened in front of her and she couldn't question or to ask about it. You know, she was always getting rescued by Ichigo or Nisama or Rukia, I mean, or, um, or Renji. So she used to get rescued a lot now, right? And now she's a captain and she's a mother. So... Her demeanor has got to be changed a lot in this hell arc. And I'm definitely looking forward to seeing what type of a person she is and what type of captain she's grown into. I know not much about her character is going to like change, but there's going to be a lot of underlying things about this character that are going to change for sure. So I'm definitely looking forward to that. Atao Ringdo, he is the new lieutenant of squad seven. And if I believe that, and that is... Iba, that's Iba squad, which used to be Sajin squad. So this is the the new lieutenant of that. If you guys have not seen the Hell Arc chapter, I like I literally did a whole review. I broke everything down. I will put that in a little tag up there. Make sure you guys check that out, man. This is the newest Bleach arc. This is the newest Bleach chapter. Like if you haven't read it, like what are you doing? Yu Yu Yayahara. Looks like she has something to do with Kisuke and Yoruichi by how she's drawn and she's like super goofy. She's like she's like the pop star, right? Like 
she's like the influencer type of person. I, obviously, I know her name is Yayahara, but like, you know, Ishin changed his name, right? He didn't, he didn't want the Sheba clan associated with Ichigo's name. So, um, it could be something with Yodoichi. Maybe her and Kisuke are both exiled. We don't know that. This is speculation, but a lot of people are drawing the conclusion that she does have some similarity to Yodoichi. Definitely the Mayuri from the Hell Arc. Um, the image at the beginning of it, he was like all the way far in the back. You could barely see him, but this is the exact same pose that the Mayuri's taking. They're calling him Scarab or Beetle Mayuri. So, you know, that's... You know that that's that's this is our new Mayuri. Kempachi looks amazing. He still has on the eye patch, which is very interesting because the whole thing with Unahana has already happened. So he still chooses to limit himself, even though he's gotten a lot stronger. So makes sense. You know his personality wouldn't change in that regard. But this is a definitely some grisly art. Like this looks amazing. Like top notch. Like this looks very very good my boy tosh um honestly i wish the tosh picture would have been a little more um ferocious you know like the pose is very drippy like th the pose is drippy like you know unsheathing the zanpak toe a bit like with this nice like you know hunched over kind of pose like looks very drippy Personally, I just wish there was like a little more color somewhere. You know what I mean? But I know he's like a captain or whatever. Like just like for example, like look at the expression on Kenny's face. You know what I mean? Like I would have liked for Toast to kind of have looked a little bit more mature or something like that. But uh, Kuchiki Byakuya, uh, his outfit's different. He has like a blue little shoulder garb there. And it looks like he has like a blue like fasten type of deal. Uh, very interesting, very interesting. Like, this this doesn't really give me a lot, you know, on Biakia, to be honest with y'all. Like, you know, like, it's it's a very narrow angle for him. Oh my gosh, bro. This Yoruichi looks so good, bro. Oh, her fit looks amazing L look at the like the like black undershirt like the lining of her undershirt like bro honestly like bro this looks like her body is crazy bro it looks like her body is crazy this outfit is my favorite ever oh my gosh bro this this yodoichi looks so freaking good I really hope whenever we see her, this is how she looks, bro. You feel me? Like, I love the look on her face. I like the action. I love the pose. And I love the drip, bro. This looks too cool to be Kisuke. I don't even think Kisuke thinks he's this cool, bro. Like, you feel me? Like, he looks super dope. Like, he looks like he is, bro. Like, he's, like, flapping in the wind, bro. Like, He's about to do it up. You feel me? This Kisuke looks very, very good. Halibel, bruh. Look at this freaking Halibel. The Bleach anime won't be censored. So, you know, blood, boobs, we gonna be seeing it, okay? You can't really see Halibel's face very much, but her outfit looks crazy. She looks like the queen of Waco Mundo. Oh my God, bruh, this no. Bro, this nail. This nail looks fantastic, bro. Kubo is getting insane at female anatomy. I remember years ago in like one of the Club Kubo things, he was talking about like he wasn't very good at drawing female bodies at the start of Bleach. Ooh, that's changed a lot because how her boobs are making like a shadow on her like stomach and like everything is shaded. Literally amazing. This looks like better than a lot of the images that we've seen. And this Grimjow looks so dope. I love that Grimjow is like about leather and like jackets and stuff. Bro, he looks so dope. He looks incredible, bro. 
He looks absolutely incredible. All right, that's pretty much it. The character that you're seeing exactly how they are will be drawn and eventually animated in the Bleach Hell Art. If you have not read the one shot, I will link it down in the description, my full review of it, okay? I will link that down low in the description as well as in the pinned comment. These images are the most recent images of every one of these Bleach characters. And we won't probably get anything more recent for them in at least a few months. Hopefully, the Bleach Hell Arc Chapter 1 will come out because how Kubo will do it, the initial one will be chapter zero and then um the next one will be you know chapter one basically right so this is the essentially the final image and this is of all of the characters basically that we just you know that i just showed and went over with you guys there's one that we were missing and we were missing jackie so uh jackie is like right up there we, were, I, we weren't able to get the image of Jackie, but we literally have all these other images. So um, a huge shout out to my boy Joe. Shout out to my boy James Hansen, Mr. Tomo, no memes. I love both of you guys. I love everybody, bro. James, Clyde, Seth, Bleach Center, Soul Madness, Simo Urahata, anyone else that's been doing Bleach content that's teching of course that's stuck by and been true to it i'm humbled bro because we did it people said bleach would never come back it's back and it's trending number one in the world right now if you're a bleach fan if you've been loyal to this series bro stand up give yourself a round of applause and please continue to support bleach keep the hype drawn up as much as we can we want bleach video games a lot of them okay we want bleach games we want merch we want movies we want all that stuff so you guys got to keep doing what you're doing right now keep talking about bleach keep making it number one i sincerely appreciate you beautiful loyal folks till next time i love y'all the next bleach video i'm out